back here with another Costa Rica thrift haul video. And it ain't the first, and it probably will be the last on YouTube for sure. But I know I'm the first from Costa Rica to do this. So here's what came down from the thrifts of Canada and the United States that were sold at auction by the kilo and then put on containers and shipped all across Central America. And here's something that came down, a nutmeg. I paid up for this, I gave 20 bucks for this, actually about 18. You know, I'll never buy something NASCAR again. They're slow movers and there just seems to be a lot of it. But the beauty of this stuff is if you don't sell it, you can keep it. And there's the old famous Dale Earnhardt Rip Nutmeg. This, I paid a dollar, but it's a made in the USA Nike with that paper thin cotton blend. I don't know what I'll get for. This is a Burberry Brit in the classic Novacek plaid color that everybody recognizes. Paid two bucks for it. I already sold it this morning for 65 plus 15 shipping. I liked it because it fit me like a glove, you know, and I never had them. And... But I'm not a hoarder, I'm a reseller. Gone. This picked up on a two for one sale, so it came out to about a dollar. It's just a North Face long sleeve t shirt. Hugo Boss track jacket with the green tag. Paid a dollar for it. Had a couple little stains on there. I think I got them off. I don't know. But for a buck, these are $200 new. You cannot pass it. So there you go. This I paid $5.50 for, but it's new with tags. And it's authentic Nike product. As you can see, the Celtic Football Club, 1888. They don't have a lot of value, but again, if it doesn't sell, I wear it. I love it. I love it for five bucks Nike. Here we go. Reebok, Joe Namath, Double XL, Mitchell and Ness. Sorry, I said Reebok. It's Mitchell and Ness. Twelve bucks. I mean, no. Four dollars, number twelve. Another infamous one, Jim Brown, in the medium, and this is a Reebok. Another four dollars. I always pick up football jerseys, uh, as long as they got a good name and they're under five or six bucks, I get them all day long. Here's the one I got with the North Face on a two for one, so I paid about a dollar for this. And you can tell, if you're watching Hearts Pickers, it's the old Tommy Finger label, vintage. So good stuff. More North Face, and I love this. The old hoodie sweatshirt but with the big spell out. 1968, four bucks. Classic FUBU 05 jersey with all the whistles and bells and the neon green with the blood red. Another four dollars. It's just hard to pass up. Here's one I got for a dollar that nobody wanted. It needed a little cleaning, a little TLC, and some threads cut and some ironing. I got that for a dollar. And it's in the Tennessee Titans colorway. You just can't beat these prices. Now here's one I got for another dollar. It's an old school Tommy Hilfinger. Boop. Kind of simple, but with the color block and the eco green. I paid one dollar for it. It just had a lot of dog hairs and these little balls. You know, some people with these pets, God bless you if you got them, but you end up wearing your pets. Really, you do. Here's one I got for a dollar. Another one. Old school Hilfinger. Old school. Simple, but yet nice. Kind of a coach jacket. Wrestling jacket. Just simple hill finger, but 
These prices are hard to beat. Now here we go. Picked this up at the same place I got the other North Face sweaty. Four dollars. It's a pullover with a marsupial kangaroo pocket. And it's just sweet. Oh, this. Another beautiful Adidas old school color block with the spell out abstract front and back. And I paid uh, $3 for this. Another Tommy Hilfinger that is uh, with the full zip, traditional colors, color block neck, vintage tags. Ended up paying five bucks for this. And it took me a while to get all the dog and cat hairs out. Jeez. But there's not one on it now, and it's perfectly clean, ready to go. Here's another football jersey, and maybe that's why it fell to the floor. Michael Vick in his prime Atlanta Falcon days, 2004. They're headed to the playoffs. A lot of people don't like these because of his history with dogs, but hey, he did his time and now he's got a foundation and he made up for his wrongs. Michael Vick. Here's one I paid two bucks for, another Nike's original color block, marsupial pockets with the hood, nothing special, nothing but just good Nike product. Two bucks, how do you beat that? You Ivy League people, I got the Harvard pullover. Pro player large. You gotta love it with the official Harvard seal on there. Paid two bucks for that. Rutgers, another Ivy League school. Three big money boys. Campus Heritage, extra large. Cherry Red, two dollars. Tommy Hilfinger, not the old school, but the early 2000s model, but in the pink track jacket. Spell out Tommy Hilfiger. Can't beat it. Another four dollars. This one I paid uh, seven dollars, but it's just unbelievable. It's the shiny satin Adidas Chili 62 gold thread embroidered with the trefoil flower, triple stripes, seven bucks, and I love it. It's just old school and it's beautiful. Now, Tommy Finger. Tommy Finger, Hill Figure. <laughs> <laughs> Athletics. This is old school. When I first saw it, I, I didn't think it was original, but I did some research, and there was an athletics brand where they were angular, and it's just a pretty old school rain jacket, windbreaker, whatever. Paid uh, almost five bucks for that, but I like it. Last but not least, Simple green with the little white pony. Ralph Polo Lauren. Couldn't pass it for two bucks. Fits. Put it up on the eBay. We'll see what it does. So anyway, that's another thrift haul. There should be more. I'll be doing some sales update videos if I ever figure out how to do screencasts and get a microphone. But we will keep them coming. Thanks for watching. Take it easy. See you soon, Mom. Hopefully you get these prices cheaper in the States, but I doubt it. Peace.